in the general sense, he'd be very honored that the museum was thinking of acquiring this, uh, such a body of work in, in honor of him, um, and he'd like that. Um, and you know, he was proud of everything he made. Dad, Dad was so much about accessibility. And because this collection is going to a museum instead of some private collector, it, it will be accessible to, to everyone to come and look at. In the vein of Harold's dedication to this community, this has really been a, a community effort to put this show together, both from the perspective of community support for the acquisition itself. He really holistically devoted himself to this community and this region. He was integral to participating in the development of statewide arts legislation. He mentored a number of local and regional artists. This is a really unique opportunity for um, the community to come and experience Harold's work uh, in the gallery here. Usually these kinds of collections are not available. And so the fact that we have an opportunity to purchase this whole collection is extraordinary. And I think it really is going to impact what we can do here in the MAC to tell the story of art in the inland Northwest. So what's nice about this collection, it is where these extremes meet. It's a particularly productive point in his life. And I think the, to have that entire collection intact is really important.